what's up welcome back to my channel we're gonna be doing a vlog for you guys this is gonna be a week in my life vlog but we're starting on a sunday because it just feels right and we're stopping on wednesday because then thursday i'm gonna start a new vlog and it's gonna be my birthday festivities i am so excited some of my best friends delaney and caitlin are flying up this coming weekend for my birthday so i'm so pumped which means i need to get my life together i need to get back on my workout grind i need to get stuff ready for my apartment i'm also going to Rhode Island this week. I, lots of random things are happening, all right? But that means it's gonna be a good vlog for you guys. Um, so I had a really nice relaxing morning to myself this morning, posted a video, the whole nine yards, and now I'm pushing myself to go work out. Ever since I moved to New York, I've just been having trouble getting inspired to work out, and I just haven't had time, but I recently found OpenFit, which is an app that you guys can use to get your at-home workouts, which is just so clutch. My apartment building does have a gym, which I'm really thankful for. And this video is sponsored by OpenFit, so thank you guys so much for sponsoring this video. So OpenFit is a joint fitness and nutrition online resource that allows you to kind of see everything all in one place, live workouts, nutrition tips. It's kind of just your one-stop shop. <laughs> they offer a ton of different programs, all different trainers too. There's the four weeks of focus, which is the one I'm interested in. Shay Mitchell is actually on that one, which is really cool. There's bar classes, there's Pilates, there's one that's called Just Bring Your Body. There's something for everyone at any level, which made it a lot less intimidating for me and just super easy. So like I said, I'm gonna be doing the four weeks of focus, which is with one of the trainers, Kelsey and Shay Mitchell. And it's really cool because they're very real during the classes they like show that they're struggling but then also laughing about it but also getting a good workout in at the same time and it just makes it a lot like i said earlier a lot less intimidating so that's what i'm going to be doing today um i just download the app on my phone you can put it on your ipad your tv you can kind of figure out whichever is best for you headed down to my gym right now i'm really nervous i hope no one else is there right now because i'm about to film myself while i work out <laughs> and there's a variety of challenging workouts so no two workouts are ever the same which is really nice so I, while I was talking, I really wanted to be putting on my sneakers and I was just into talking about open fits, so I kind of forgot. But we are going to head down right now, get a quick little workout in for the day, just so I feel like I started my day off right before we get started with the rest of the day. Sounds of the city, can you guys hear that? Hey, if you guys are interested, you can click the link down below and you can actually get a 21 day free trial, which is so nice. Um, so then you don't have to pay anything and you can see how you like it and we can do this four weeks of focus together I mean four weeks come on easy boom done such I've seen such a change in my mental health Just when I start my day with a workout It's always kind of hard to get yourself to get up and work out But then after you do it, you're like, oh that was awesome. So just keep that in mind. Anyways Thank you again to open fit for sponsoring this video Let's go get a good workout in and then start the rest of the day. Welcome to my vlog and subscribe if you're new here. So there were like a thousand dudes in the gym and there was just no way I was going to film my workout. So I thought it would be even cooler to come to my roof. Just look at the Empire State Building while I work out. You guys cool with that? I don't have a mat or anything, but it's okay. You don't need that for this. So I'm on week two. So we've got day eight lower body strength. All right, you guys. I'm pumped. Let's do this. I got my heart rate up and all kinds of worked out, but it was really honestly kind of nice to do on the rooftop. I literally just went downstairs, you guys, and there were a ton of guys in the gym, and I was like, no, no, no. Even though confidence, yes, but since I was filming, I was like, no. Um, but it was so good. Definitely need a shower now. Um, so yeah, you guys can check out the link down below if you want to try out the free trial. Felt like I was working out with Shay Mitchell and her trainer, and like, who doesn't want that? So I'm starting the shower now. Getting the vibes right. Let's start the day. I simply just don't have my life together, neither does Ryan. Um, my boyfriend just moved here um, like a week after me and he's been like working from 7 a.m. to like 10 p.m. every day and hasn't been able to, you know, get his apartment all settled. I've been go, go, go because it's been New York Fashion Week. So today we're kind of taking a day to relax, unwind, but also do some things, maybe go to Bed Bath & Beyond, run some errands, take some trash out, organize, like there's just things I want to do today. Yeah, we're just gonna see how the day goes. So it'll just be like a nice Sunday, um, 
Sunday evening. I'll show you guys my outfit. I just got ready. I'm just wearing this fun little summery outfit because I know it's going to be fall really soon. So this top is from Revolve. I'll link it below. It's just a fun little yellow smock top. Jeans are from Dish. Don't know what shoes yet. Either white sneakers, my white All Saints, not my Air Force Ones. Don't worry. I don't think that would go with this. Ryan's here. <laughs> Sunday football, baby. Football. Came over to get some work done and watch some football. He's getting together a list of essentials that he needs. Still He's still working on it. He's like, can, just, can opener? Nah, I was like, you're gonna need that. <laughs> That's exactly how I was too. My mom was like, you know, just get it. You're gonna need it. <laughs> so, shopping day, Are you excited? Ugh, I hate shopping. He hates shopping. I'm like having to drag him to this place, but you'll be thankful later. Hello, New York. <laughs> Brian's got his backpack on, he refuses to. Ryan's got a backpack on, I've got a tote bag. We're headed to the subway, we're gonna go to Bed Bath & Beyond. Um, we're gonna help Ryan get the essentials. We just went to his apartment to kind of see. They they really only have three plates, three bowls, or four plates, four bowls, two spoons. Yeah, we got like a fork. A fork, no uh, cups. All three boys work very hard jobs all day, so completely understandable, but I'm stepping in. And we're gonna go to Bed Bath Beyond and maybe lunch too. Yeah. Actually, definitely lunch. Um, but yeah, it's a really beautiful day. Everyone's out and about. Feels good to like walk around for sure. So, let's go. Checking his football stats. Guy on the go right here. Ryan in his natural habitat. We're in the protein powder store. <laughs> On the west side now, we've got Bed Bath & Beyond, Old Navy. We're trying to find a place to eat lunch. I just met a subscriber, she was really cool. Ryan just got some protein powder. Wait, Ryan, there's like a food festival up ahead. This whole street is blocked off, this is so cool. I'm walking in. I feel so free just walking down the street. Ended up at Dos Toros for lunch. Good spot, I believe it's a chain. Got some tacos. All right, here we go, Bed Bath & Beyond time. Ryan, you ready? Yep. There are so many cool little gadgets in this store. Ryan needs a pasta strainer. Here we go. All right, Ryan, which silverware do you want? <laughs> Whatever's cheapest. All right. <laughs> Easy enough. You don't care about the finish? Shiny or matte? Oh, well, that's kind of neat. Look at that. These? Yeah. Yeah, they're yeah, cool. They're cool. Just comparing them. <laughs> Just comparing <laughs> These are pretty cool. Look at that. Oh, that's really cool. Are those the... Oh, of course those are like the most expensive ones. Gosh darn. Montana. Okay, I love this. I might have to purchase this. That's so funny. Pothead. Okay, this is so true though. I literally asked my dad things I could Google. All I need is coffee and mascara. Sorry, I was on mute. Oh my God, you have to get one of these. These are hilarious. All right, I'd say Ryan, you keep spinning and I can't. I think you got some good stuff. Yeah. Proud of you. Blackout curtains. I got a couple things. He got a coffee machine, coffee, raw. I'm proud of you. This is good. Your roommates will be happy. Nice. It's coming together. So I just helped Ryan uh, put away all of his stuff, and I got a couple of things at Bed Bath and Beyond too. I thought I'd show you guys really quick. I got this. Um, two-in-one sink strainer and stopper because they don't have kitchen disposals here or like sink disposals I'm not used to that so this one when I take it out because there'll be food in it I can put it in the trash and go like this so it like pops out and all the food gets out easier I don't know I'm just having trouble with that I got another mug I'm trying to add to my mug collection because I only have four and you guys know how much I love mugs I literally had to this First of all, I love how big of a cup it is, like a big cup of joe. And the udders, this is hilarious, golden. Um, 
Got some Listerine breath spray. The stuff at the checkout counter really gets you. And then I got a mini thing of Q-tips because people always ask if I have them and I never do. And I should probably have them. But Ryan asked if I'd go with him to Ace Hardware to get some door hinges. He's like hanging up a desk because his room is so small. Like he's gonna, he has this thing he can use as a desk, but he has to like fold it up if he wants to be able to open the door. So I'm gonna help him. It's a Frank Sinatra night, making pasta. We're back now, Ryan's trying to um, do some things in his apartment. And I'm gonna cook his dinner because I'm a good girlfriend. <laughs> Hi girls. <laughs> We're FaceTiming while I'm cooking. We're doing broccoli, bonza, chickpea pasta. Yum. Just FaceTime my dad while cooking. I've never had this shape of bonza pasta. I'm excited. It's cavatappi, I believe. And what I do actually is I pour, so since the pot's already hot, um, I pour my sauce in there and it pretty much warms it up right away and then I pour the pasta in, boom, done, fold it all together. Broccoli's done. Chickpea pasta with broccoli, it's a pretty nutritious meal. I gotta say, vibes are right in my apartment today. Now this is a main character moment. Eating, Ryan's still hanging something up and he said I could go ahead and eat, but he's getting me eggs and paper towels, so I'm hype about that. Um, yeah, I'm gonna eat. But yeah, I'm just gonna enjoy my dinner. Ryan brought me some eggs and I put them in my little egg holders. A very happy boy. His last night without Wi-Fi, so I've got him here for Sunday night. <laughs> so it's a little later, I did some computer stuff. Ryan's still working. And I literally did this laundry like, I don't know, four days ago. <laughs> and it's still all in the dryer. Do you guys ever do this? Like, okay, I washed it, dried it. Now it's just waiting for me to fold it. <laughs> so that's kind of where I'm at right now. And I'm trying to decide it's like 11 o'clock. Do I want to go down this path of folding right now? Probably should. But do I want to? No, I don't want to. And I also, like I almost, if I do, I wanted them to be like a little hot. So maybe I'll just do a little fluff and then I'll fold if I'm in the mood when it's done. <laughs> Hopefully I'm not shrinking anything too much. Folding laundry, watching the VMAs. It's like they already happened two hours ago but now they're rerunning it. So I'm enjoying this. Ryan just left, Shawn Mendes is on. I'm gonna run the dishwasher. Folded my laundry. This is exactly how I like to spend my Sunday nights. It just feels like I have my life together, starting the week off right. I feel like everyone agrees with that. Dishes are a go. I'm so cozy right now. And Kenzie's podcast merch shorts, a big sweatshirt. I kind of feel like going to the rooftop and like thinking about life for a second. Should we go? Headed to the roof because why not? I just want to like get some fresh air before I go to bed. I seriously love coming up here. I am so thankful I have a rooftop, like it, oh, I can't believe I live here. You know, over the last week I've seen a lot of people I know and meeting new people obviously, and everyone's like, how is it going? How is, you know, the transition? I don't know, I like I have not had an ounce of homesickness. I haven't felt uncomfortable, like it just, it just feels so right and it's so weird. Like. There's no growing pains. Like with college, it was so hard. And I really just didn't know if it was right for me. And it ended up being right. And I love Georgia and I miss it so much already. But like, it's just, it shows like how I really am in the right place. Like I've dreamed about this for so long, but I was nervous that what if it wasn't actually for me, but I'm just loving it. And everything's just right where it needs to be. My days flow, everything just flows. I hope this inspires you guys that if you're going through a rough time or you're not obsessed with the place you're in life right now, like, doesn't mean it's gonna be forever. Back in my humble abode now. <laughs> gonna head to bed, putting my hydro jug <laughs> right next to it. Switching to red lights so I relax. I will link these colored light bulbs down below from Amazon. I seriously have gotten the best sleep of my life in this room. And I think it's definitely a part of it is because of my Casper mattress and because I can finally control my own air. Like obviously living at home, my mom and I are on the same like vent. 
um, and she doesn't like it super cold. I love my comforter, I love my sheets, my Brooklyn and sheets. And then also just having this red light at night I think really relaxes me, I don't know. I think also because my room isn't cluttered at all and I'm really trying to keep it a very safe zen space rather than, oh, I do work in here too. I mean, yeah, I get in bed and do stuff, but I think it's working, I think it's helping. So I will see you guys in the morning. Good morning, happy Monday, big day for Ryan. He's getting Wi-Fi today and he's so excited. This is my last morning waking up to the sound of sweet Ryan on conference calls. Gonna miss it. It'll be good for you to have your own space. I'm at my little office here. <laughs> About to do a little linking spree on my Instagram of all of my New York Fashion Week outfits. I love doing weekend recaps of my outfits and linking everything on like Sunday night or Monday. So I'm doing that this Monday morning. So go follow me on Instagram, at Danielle Carolyn. Just finished linking. I'm really proud of myself. I always love doing these. I love when other people do them too. So hopefully people like it. <laughs> breakfast time. Watching YouTube as I eat breakfast. Woo! All right guys, we're starting the day off with some errands. Didn't feel like putting together an outfit, so outdoor voices exercise dress it is. Aviators, little tote bag, sneakers. Brooke and I both need to go to the post office, so we thought we'd walk together. I need to go to the bank to get some blank checks because I don't have my checkbook up here. And we're gonna stop by Trader Joe's. So it's a fun little errands morning. Trader Joe's time. I'm gonna pop into my bank really quick, get my checks, and then meet you back, buddy. Go get your fall items from Trader Joe's. <laughs> this is the biggest Trader Joe's on the East Coast, and it gets me every time. I found her. Huh? Oh, I know. Hash browns. Those look like McDonald's they hash browns. <gasps> Need those look are those in the frozen yes. section? Should we go back? Yeah, maybe. Oh my god, the cinnamon broom, oh, iconic. I have to have to walk home with it, buddy. <laughs> a witch. Should we get snacks for the trip? Yes, we should get snacks because for the trip. I'm just con you know when we get hungry. <laughs> yeah, we do get hungry. Yeah. So guys, we have a road trip tomorrow. I don't even think I've talked about it yet. Just a one-day one road trip to Rhode Island, but Brooke had the idea to get some snacks. Well, the thing is, whenever we go on these trips, Danielle and I are like in between meals. And we're like, oh, we're so hungry. We're like starving. <laughs> you, I don't want to like inconvenience the trip. You know what I mean? No, yeah, we, we need to just. Take care of it now. We take care of it now, so that when we're hungry, we don't have to yeah. stress out and. I know, I've been looking at this. Okay, have you ever had movie good. theater? I like the, just like, that's just like plain. Yeah, the I'll Ohio get it. I mean, yeah. Bag, but we need... Wait, wait, I so know. we just put that on the cracker. Yes. Oh well, my gosh. Like or we could do like half yes. and half. Well, wait, those are so cute. Yeah. Mini Brie Bites. Mini We're gonna be so yeah. bougie in this road trip. <laughs> <laughs> Successful, yeah. Brooke's got her broom. Yeah, yeah. Everything. It's really worth it. It's gonna make my closet smell amazing. Your closet's gonna be smelling fire. All right, time for a little Trader Joe's haul. We got some popcorn, like I was saying. Brooke and I are going to Rhode Island tomorrow for the day with Essie. So we wanted to get some snacks for the road trip and just to have in the hotel room. I got bagels. I just really love bagels. They're just so delicious. And sesame is my fave. Oh my gosh, Brooke inspired me. I simply had to. Um, I have to tell Ryan about these. He's gonna die. They're so good. They literally look like McDonald's hash browns. Um, they're in the frozen section. Got pita bite crackers that, um, and then Brooke got little brie bites to have. It'd be a nice little snack. Just got one thing of the chicken burritos from Trader Joe's. They're just a great dinner if I'm just eating alone or need a quick lunch. And then I just got three apples. Just showered and decided to send it and wash my hair. I just, sometimes you just need the full refresh. And I'm gonna need to wash it tonight anyways before we go to Rhode Island tomorrow. So we're just doing it now. I'm going to put all of my towels in the wash. I'm finally getting my hair touched up on Wednesday and I could not be more excited you guys 
my roots be coming in. My extensions are like dangling. They are ready to be lifted. I've got a full setup right here. Yeah, I need to get my vlog camera in. It's fine. Brooke looks so much cuter so, than me. No, I have to film. I'm doing like Instagram stories for your brand after this. I was just like, I have to get ready. Today. No, no, no. It's good. I ended up washing my hair, so I had to like take a lot of time. I just like, I knew I needed to wash it tonight, so I was like, I'll just wash it now. Yeah, totally. So I couldn't do makeup, but I love this little setup we've got going. It's so cool recording with a guest together in person, so at least we're together. Yeah, it just makes it easier because otherwise it's three people talking over each other, but in this case we could. Yeah, like, this is great. Pleasure. I love it. Yeah, Cute setup. All right, now we're about to record an episode for Gals on the Go that will be up by the time you guys are watching this. You should totally go listen if you have a lot of curiosity about New York Fashion Week because I think we learned a lot about Fashion Week this week or last week that we didn't really know, and we're just gonna be talking about the nitty gritty of it, how we felt. How you compare yourself to other people, just everything. So we're about to do a whole debrief of New York Fashion Week. I'm really excited about this episode. Me I think too. people are really gonna like it. I went to a bodega and just got some iced coffee. And then after this, I had to go get a wax. We love European Wax Center. So and it's right near Washington Square Park. So I'm thinking about going there. Just got back from recording. You guys are going to love this episode. Just change it to some sneakers because we are headed to European Wax Center taking the subway, so I'm gonna be walking a little bit more. Totes are just the way to go. I'm learning here, I need my AirPods. All right, we made it. Let's do this. Just got home, went to the supermarket. I'll show you guys what I got. I just got stuff to make dinner. Um, but I want to watch the Met Gala. I'm so mad. I missed some of the Met Gala already. Like they're they're doing like I guess it's not the red carpet, just the walk before. And I wanted to watch, and I honestly just figured it would start at you know seven o'clock, but it's already started. So and I know I already missed Emma Chamberlain walk. I don't know who else. I just saw it quickly on my phone. So I am in just such a great mood. Obviously I got a wax, which is always just exciting. You just feel so clean and great after. Um, I walked all the way back. I walked past Washington Square Park, which is really, really nice. Um, and I talked to my mom, I talked to my dad, I talked to Brooke. Brooke and I literally just talk like all the time and we see each other all the time. We just are always calling each other, okay? So now it's just easier than texting. Talked to Ryan, um, he's been working all day and we wanna like cook something tonight and like hang out tonight because, just like be more intentional about it. Sometimes we just wanna be more intentional about hanging out rather than like, Yes, he's been with me a lot this past week, but like him working, me working, in and out, maybe we'll have dinner together. We wanna have like an evening. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna go with this. But I went on a walk, I stopped by the supermarket and grabbed stuff to just make dinner tonight. I know I went to Trader Joe's this morning with Brooke, but I just got like random little essentials and I just, I've always said I wanna be on that level where it's like I just stop by the market on the way home pick out what I want to eat and make for dinner that night and just have those ingredients. Because when you go grocery shopping, sometimes it's hard to know, you know, what you're going to want to eat for the next week. Delaney and I had a good system. We would plan out our meals. That's because we were students and we had to, but I'm thankful that I do have a little bit more time in that regard. And I live so close to all these grocery stores. Um, so I talked to Ryan on the phone. He'll be working till 8.30, but I hope we get to like cook together. But yeah, so Brooke and I are going to Rhode Island tomorrow with Essie. I'm so excited. Like I said, we're staying at this... Seems to be a really nice hotel, just one night. It'll be a fun little just getaway, I'm so excited. That's something I was really excited about living in New York for is that you can get so many places really quick. It's like the states are smaller and there's just a lot up here in New England. I'm so excited too because like I've used Essie nail polish for so long. Like I used to have a whole nail polish rack in my room with like Essie nail polishes if you guys remember back from my old videos. It's a pretty chill itinerary, which I love. It seems like they really just want us to relax. So, and I really, there's no need to overpack. Like I will not be bringing a suitcase. It's literally one night, but I just got these two dresses in the mail from Realization Par. They're beautiful. And I was just telling Brooke, I wish I had more daytime dresses to just wear with like sandals or sneakers. And it's a whole outfit. I just got these two. This is a short sleeve one with cherries on it. It's like a wrap dress. And so is this one, but it's polka dot. So I think that's perfect. And then I also have a little bit more of a dressier dress that I rented from Fashion Pass that I didn't know I'd wear to, so I'm gonna try that on as well. So yeah, that's kind of my train of thought. Cleaned up in here, it's nice and clean. But anyways, I am just gonna pack, put the sound back on so I can watch this. I love the commentary. And yeah, that's the update. Ryan's here and he brought beer. That rhymes. <laughs> Cheers. 
Pacifico. We love it. A little beer night, a little country. We're about to start cooking. If you know, you know. I literally shipped this thing from Athens because I love it that much. I got it on Amazon. You literally just pull it. <laughs> Freaking amazing, like boom done. Not to flex, but we've got a whole little taco bar going. Oh yeah, baby. Monday night football on, whiskey yeah. Myers. Now that is beautiful. Cheers. Bon appetit. Just doing some light packing for Rhode Island. Um we're going for a day, but I looked at the itinerary and there's some like different events happening throughout the day. And I just want to have a couple different options in case like everyone's wearing jeans and I'm wearing a dress, vice versa. We just cleaned up dinner and I went down to the mail room and my Apple TV came. I went back and forth between Roku and Apple TV and I was more familiar with Apple TV. Um, so I'm really excited to set this up because the smart, this is technically a smart TV, but honestly, it's so confusing and I can't find any of the apps and it's just not organized well. So I'm excited to use this guy. Guys, every single night, this is such a vibe. Like, oh my gosh. Good morning, you guys. Reason 60,400 why I love New York City. I just 15, 20 tampons. <laughs> Brooke said amazing, I just told her. I literally love New York, tampons and Starbucks. <laughs> Got a vanilla sweet cream cold brew and a turkey bacon sandwich. Good morning, guys. Good morning. Good morning. We've got all the goods for yeah. our road trip. <laughs> guys, we're in, a we're in a Tesla right now. This so is so cool. <laughs> Love it. Here we go, Rhode Island. We're at a little rest stop right now. Yay. And we're having our little brie bites and crackers. We love it. We're in Connecticut right now. It's so cool. You can get yeah. everywhere so fast. Yeah, the tri-state area is like nice like that, that it's all yeah. very connected. And then a little cracker. Yes, I even We're almost to the hotel now. We're like driving through this super yes. quaint town. It's so cute. So cute. So Relax. Rhode Island. So yeah. Rhode Island. I'm so excited. It's just <laughs> so pretty. Oh my god. The ocean! All right, we're all set up at the hotel. We are in the spa bathroom. I'm so relaxed right now. This place is beautiful. I can't wait to show you guys more, but um, we're frantically, actually, we're peacefully getting ready. Um, <laughs> we like came in hot in like our lounge clothes and there's like a dress code at this hotel. <laughs> It's people outside the event, we like saw them from afar and they're all like third to lounge. I know, so we're like, wait, B or B, gotta go put on dresses and get yes. dressed up, so. Little transformation before. We did it, Joe. This is my dress. It's from Realization Park. I love it. I'm wearing my Converse with it because I'm just so quirky. Oh, I'm wearing sneakers with my dress. We're, you know, <laughs> love it. We're real, show, show your real girls. I'm so much going to tea. I love it. This is um, I like my breath. Breath and, and real. You guys, we just got our toesies done, white and pink. Walking down the stairs, we're headed to lunch by the beach. I'm so excited. I they said, do you want indoor or outdoor? I said, Danielle, definitely want <laughs> No, whatever you want to do, buddy. I, I feel like it makes sense, though. I know. Taylor Swift's house over there. We'll get a better look over there. She is the moment. Oh, this is so pretty. We're literally in our, like, pedicure flip-flops walking to the restaurant. <laughs> Side right now. Like the definition of living. Looking at Taylor Swift's house. Like, <gasps> oh, oh, where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Gone? It's gone. <laughs> you get that on I really hope so. There was a brook. There was a brook. <laughs> no, no, it's gone. It's gone. That's Taylor Swift's house right there. We're looking at the water. I just, I'm so thankful for this. It's so beautiful. I told Danielle it would be a pocket piece. I know. Brooke's like, we'll sit by the beach. That's what Danielle would want. <laughs> My brain has two functions. It's what does Brooke want and what does Danielle want. <laughs> and we like try to balance it yeah. out. 
I mean, even the bathroom is like beautiful. Guys, so I go, what time's dinner? Brooke pulls out the itinerary. And I say seven, but then I say, we have to be down here at 6.30 because I learned anything. I push things to the last minute, but Danielle really pushes things to the last minute. Like, I thought I was bad. And then, <laughs> I do. Like, oh, we have time. Like, we'll be strolling around. I'm like, we have to be at the show in an hour. No, like, yeah, <laughs> Brooke's my, my mother. On She's keeping stuff. my things in her bag. Like. <laughs> <laughs> lunch time. I'm Yay. like, this is like the perfect little beach lunch. She got a lobster roll. Yeah, it's a late lunch. It's like, yeah. yeah so, so, uh, yeah, it's almost three. I got a club wrap. Just still relaxing. And apparently, Taylor Swift sold that house back there. So, false alarm. Yeah. Getting fitted for some custom sandals. These are the ones Brooke's gonna do. I'm gonna do this with the white croc, which I think is gonna look really cute. Very. Brooke's getting fitted. So we just checked in. We got sparkling wine. Love this place. It's very, very nice. Here's our room. Here's all of our snacks from the road trip. This is gorgeous, you guys. The the hotel, like the bathroom is ginormous. Robes, everything. And then we come over here. TV, a tub. You can look out. We'll have to close these when each other are showering. This is just so stunning. Is this a little water thing? Maybe not, maybe not. And then we come out here. There's so a brook. Nice. It's so nice. It's so I nice. I feel like, oh, it's like an elevated, beautiful bedroom. Yeah. In like a house. It's like weird because it's an interesting mix of, it's not weird. It's cool that it's an interesting mix of like modern and antique vibes, you know? Because it's, yeah. Like antique vibes, you're like, oh, this is very antique. This is like. This is modern. relaxing. A kiss of modern. Yes, <laughs> a kiss of modern, very Rhode Island. It is. Never been to Rhode Island, but you know what I mean. Also, we're about to do a little haul. This is gonna be so fun. Oh, I'm so excited. I love the stuff. Goodie bags! <laughs> the stuff! A little desk to have a main character moment and do your makeup. And then a really pretty view of the ocean and the island, I guess. Is that the right term? Because uh, it's beach. like a point over there. Like, you oh, can see the oh, beach yeah, yeah, and then yeah, yeah. it stops at Taylor Swift's house. <laughs> Just the end right of near. The road. <laughs> Oh, this is so beautiful. We just had lunch by the beach. I still have my little flip flops on. We're gonna do a little unboxing for you guys. Of uh, PR. We have both of our cameras going, so we're not like, yeah, don't mind. Sorry, I'm trying to like get them both, but um, we're very excited to be gift. I saw them walking around with this bag and I was like, I actually love this tote. What do you think is on the, like, what do you think this is? Is this the ocean house? Oh, maybe it's like an ocean oh. Oh my god, what's this? Oh my god, masks! Look how beautiful these yeah, masks are! Yeah, they're very pretty. Welcome to SE at Ocean House. We're so ha happy you could join us for some sunny business. Get ready to seize the day because any fin goes on this getaway to celebrate SE's 40th anniversary. I love it. What are we starting with? <gasps> oh, so I, yes, I love the Kerastase Elixir. Is this hair serum I was saying? Oh, you! That's weird. We manifested that for you. I we were. Like, do you have any hair serum? We get, we've got it. Oh my gosh. What else do we have? Blow dry. This is hype. Kerastase is nice. Bunch of Kerastase products. Makeup wipes, vital. Make makeup wipes, and I use this. The, like that. Oh, my cellar water. water. Yeah. Dry shampoo. I wish I brought some. Oh, wow. A lot of oh, Kerastase. I am so excited. You need <gasps> I use that. I Kerastase, and it's premium. It's such Hair premium masks. products. What are these? Wow. Things? Dock and quick dry towel. Fun. Oh, and a f are they both towels? It's I two. Guess we get two. Oh my gosh! Look how nice pretty the package is. Cellar water goes. and then love that hand for cream. Lots of love. Say, what is this uh, at the bottom? I don't know. Oh, this is I think what the brand of the toad is. Oh, that would make sense. It's Hill House. That's home. so cool. Very we cool. have so much sunscreen <gasps> Whoa, too. Whoa, that's fancy sunscreen. And then, last but not least, a sea nail polish. We love the polishes. Came to the beach. Take a take a pool girl to the beach. <laughs> what you doing? I'm not in my bathing suit. Oh, this is so this stunning. Is that really house fun. and the lighthouse over there. I think New England beaches are like different than like you, what you think. Yeah. Well, I mean, it's just a, you know. It's just like it's more a, it's um, nautical vibe. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's New England, so Boating. pretty. Listen to the waves crash. All right guys, Brooke and I just came back and we took body showers and <laughs> I don't know why that sounded really funny to me. <laughs> so 
separate body showers. And I'm looking out into the water right now. I'm sorry, babe. Um, we just got ready for dinner. It's a clam bake. I'm really excited. I don't love clams, but here is my little outfit of the night. I'm telling you guys, Realization Par is my new best friend. This dress is also from there. It's like kind of the same vibe where you wrap it as the one earlier, but it's long sleeve, black and white polka dots. Just really, really nice, easy. Didn't have to think too much about it. Just put it on. And then I just put my hair up because I was just done with it. You guys, I'm getting my hair finally done tomorrow and I'm just ready. I'm so ready. Let's see what she's up to. Oh, Brooke! Oh, she's really into makeup now. She's a makeup YouTuber again. I Brooke watched, X Beauty. I, I smudged, but I watched what the makeup artist did on us this past week and I really like paid attention. Surprise. <laughs> <laughs> you got YouTube the last of me. <laughs> yeah, uh -uh, I'm always here, baby. Look at her strut down that hallway. Cute. She got it from Fashion Pass, you guys. Fashion Pass is life. This is so relaxing out here. Taking some photos. Oh my gosh, thank you so much. Cheers to 40 years. Yay. Date on a date, do not text. Do I eat the cotton candy like that? Oh my god. <laughs> yes, you do. I know, it's so crazy. Oh, here I am. Uh, Looks so good. This is the menu and you guys eat all Espresso this. martinis. The menu oh has Caesar. our name on it. A Caesar. I love how they give us cornbread. Love. This is so cute. Everyone's just vibing. This food looks amazing. Brooke got the salmon. I got the chicken. Comes with mac and cheese and fries. I mean, say less. They literally brought us a personal birthday cake for Essie's 40th birthday party. Everyone has a little Happy cake. Birthday, Essie. Essie. That's a really cute name for a baby. Very sweet. Guys, I feel like I'm on a one-on-one -on -one date in The Bachelor, and Brooke gave me the date card. I did. I said, Danielle, will you <laughs> accept? Will, wait, what would the date well, card say? It would say like, will you let's light up our love on fire. Yes. yes. <laughs> That's let's, what the date card. Let's see if we have a spark. Yes. <laughs> this is too good. Okay, are there steps or is it just good? So cute. So cute. God, they do braid work. <laughs> oh my gosh, we just got back to our room. A nice turn down I, service. I'm so happy. There's real, there's classical music playing. Good morning, you guys. Oh, seeing the ocean is so nice. My eyes opened. I ordered room service. <laughs> no, I. Literally, our eyes cracked open at 7.30. We ordered room service, went back to bed. Guys, Delaney's coming to New York tomorrow for my birthday, and she sent me this. She's so happy. <laughs> Guys. I'm just covering the details. We just, oof, ooh, this is the first time you guys are seeing me today. We got an office space for gals on the go. As we're on the go, it's crazy. Holy shit. We did it. We did it, Joe. We did it, Joe. All right, you guys, back in the city now, headed to Mia Wagner Salon. I'm going to see Mad's hair. She is fixing these terrible roots. I look so good right now. I love it, a little espresso martini moment, Mwah. Hello everybody, it's a little later now and I just got back, I've been cleaning because I have guests coming tomorrow. Delaney and Caitlin are coming up like I was telling you guys and I have an appointment in the morning and I wanna get some work done before they get here so I can enjoy the weekend. Um, but I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog, it was kind of all over the place but we're here for it. Still can't believe I live here, don't you guys worry. I'm gonna end the vlog here because tomorrow I'm gonna start my birthday weekend vlog. <laughs> I love you guys so much. Thanks so much for constantly supporting me. Subscribe if you guys are new here. And I'll see you guys next time with my next video. Bye.